I actually wanted to uh, ask a voter question that pivots kind of nicely to the midterms. Um, they ask, this is Robert Kellaway from Maryland. He asked, should Iowa maintain its first in the nation caucus position? Now, I know that this is a question that Democrats are really grappling with, given what happened in 2020 with their own voting systems that didn't end up really declaring a winner officially. That's not necessarily happening on the Republican side. Um, well, if you could answer that question and also what would it mean if, if even one of the parties was no longer in Iowa during this time, what would it mean for the local economy there? Yeah, well, uh, thank you, Robert, for for dialing in and listening in this morning. And um, you're right. I think it would be it would be great if Iowa can maintain its first in the nation status for caucuses. Uh, it is not only a huge part of history, but it's a huge part of vetting in the presidential politics. Uh, these candidates come to Iowa, and Iowans ask some pretty tough questions. Um, I know because I've been on the receiving end of those at my 20 town halls that I've done in my district, but I think Iowans do a really great job of vetting candidates and, and uh, making sure that they're on the record on things that are important to uh, middle America and the heartland, which is a huge portion of our country. Um, so I would love to see us continue to be first in the nation status because I think we do a pretty good job of vetting those candidates. Um, as far as economic impact, it does have a huge impact to the state of Iowa. You look at all of the the candidates that come in, the campaigns that come in, the media that comes in um, and spends a significant amount of time and money here, it's a huge boost to our local economy as well. And so I would love to see it stay so we can help support, again, more of those Main Street small businesses, those small coffee shops that presidential candidates go to visit and have um, many town halls in as well. Um, I, I think we can, we can definitely make it happen. I think the Democrats learned some very important lessons from how things were executed um, in the last cycle. But I can tell you Republicans, we got it right. Um, we didn't have any problems with our caucuses and we know the system and we can make sure we execute it efficiently and, um, and make sure we're picking good candidates coming out of America's heartland.